Security agency credited with a major expansion of the organization's covert surveillance operations is due to quit early next year. Army General Keith Alexander, who is the NSA's longest serving chief, has come under intense pressure since whistleblower Edward Snowden revealed the vast scale of government snooping. RT's Marina Portnoy has the details. The man who has made indiscriminate global surveillance and data gathering part of the fabric of America is leaving his position. General Keith Alexander, director of the National Security Agency, is reportedly stepping down from his reign within the next six months. It would be hard to deny that this unexpected exodus would be happening if not for whistleblower Edward Snowden. General Alexander's eight-year tenure at the NSA came under worldwide criticism earlier this year after Dr. Snowden, a former NSA contractor, revealed details about the NSA's global gathering of telephone, email, and social media data. Foreign embassies, the United Nations, and even heads of state were allegedly targeted by America's dragnet surveillance. Political activist and author Eugene Perrier says General Alexander's resignation is more like a fall from grace. I think that the, the revelations from Snowden are playing a big role here. I mean, I think for them to say that this is just sort of a random thing. Is, is sort of absurd. I mean, it seemed like just a few months ago that Keith Alexander was being feted as this great, important general who had done all these big things. And I think after everything that's been released uh, by Mr. Snowden very heroically, that they're looking for a facelift. Initially, General Alexander defended the NSA's domestic spying practices, saying the phone surveillance program he spearheaded has thwarted 54 terrorist plots or events. As it turns out, that number was a gross exaggeration. Last week, the NSA NSA director admitted he lied. Now, America's top spy has been nicknamed Alexander the Great, a reference to all the influence and power he has amassed during his tenure. But many say that changing the face of the NSA won't likely prevent journalists from continuing to report about America's questionable surveillance practices. Glenn Greenwald, who initially broke the NSA spy scandal, has personally promised that there are many more bombshell exposés to come. Reporting from New York, Marina Portnaya, RT.